Hello, this is Billy Core from Home of Carolina Circle Mall .com. It's um, Monday afternoon, July 19th, 2010, um, and I am recording on a mini DV tape where the last video re recorded on this was dated November 27th, 2003, my 14th birthday, so uh, it's been a while since I've used this tape, so. <laughs> but I. But something very unique happened today. Um, I drove over to Value Village, the thrift store, a new thrift store here in town, which is the same place where I bought that thrift nostalgia computer of mine, and um, I found yet another item that I had to buy right off the bat. And here it is. It's still in the back seat of the car. That's right, an HP Pavilion desktop computer, 6735. Has a CD-ROM drive, floppy disk drive, Intel Celeron processor, and designed for Microsoft Windows ME. I'm guessing it's from about 2000, so it's probably about two, 10 years old or so. Uh, here's the back of it. I haven't turned it on or anything, and I'm just going to take it in. We'll take a quick look at it, and I bought a keyboard for it too. Well, here it is in the office now. Get a better look at it. Windows in me. Bill. We'll fix that. Uh, it's model 6735. I like the case design of this. Um, we used to have a Hewlett Packard computer similar to this. It was a 1999 model. It was the one we bought after the, it was our second computer after the, it was the one we got after the Packard Bell. And it was, it had Windows 98 second edition and my brother has it currently. Um, but um, let's turn it around. Okay, now we got your keyboard and mouse. Two USB ports, serial, LPT1 printer port, VGA out, game port, and a sound card and a um, 56k dial-up modem. Yeah, Hewlett Packard Pavilion 6735. There's the power supply, and it's in pretty good shape. Just the back of it looks a little bit grungy, but no big deal. Like I said, I've never powered this on before, so I don't know if it even works or not. But I'm gonna... But first thing before you turn on a computer you bought at a thrift store or Goodwill or something like that, you always want to open it up and take a look inside to see if everything's in place. So let's do that right now. Well, here's the inside of it. It's a little crowded in there, it looks like. Um, and you got your CD-ROM drive, the floppy drive, and the hard disk drive, that's, I've never seen a hard drive mounted like that before in my life. <laughs> and there's the power supply, um, 100 watt. See the motherboard there, um, I don't see the, I think this RAM is covered by an IDE cable. Yeah, I see some RAM in there. Hard to see. Well, let's hook it on up. Well, I got it all hooked up now. I got a, a mouse, keyboard, monitor, no speakers. I don't have any spare speakers nearby to hook up to it right now, but no big deal. We're just testing it for now. And it's right there. Got it all plugged up. And I've got to mention the price. It was only $8. Yeah, it was cheaper than my first Stalger computer. <laughs> so, um... Inch slowly toward the power button. I hopefully this video will be used for YouTube only and not for not to show the insurance company. And we're getting something. HP invent. I heard a beep. Yep, Windows ME. So
curious to see what all the specs of this computer are. I don't know how much RAM or what the hard drive is on it. Ugh. And so we gotta put it in a password. We'll just click cancel. Like I said, I'll probably just uh, wipe the hard drive and put something else on it. This hard drive has not been wiped at all. <laughs> oh boy. Let's see. I don't know whose computer this used to be. Slow, isn't she? <laughs> okay, here's. Let's go to system properties. I want to see what the RAM is. It's kind of slow right now, I guess, because whoever last owned this computer um, filled the hard drive up to the brim, it looks like. <laughs> 63. Okay, it's got 64 megs of RAM. Let's see what all is under device manager. Okay, an LG CD-ROM. Oh, there's a cursor. And then disk drives. Okay, Intel graphics. Floppy disk controller. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Modem. I don't care about the modem. Network adapter. Dial-up adapter. Okay, because yeah, there's not an adapter in there. Okay. Crystal WDM audio codec. Hopefully I can find a lot of these drivers on the internet if I need them for when I wipe this computer. Okay. That's a 13.9 gigabyte hard drive. And you know, I got a... I think last week I bought a... Um, 20 gigabyte hard drive from um, Goodwill. I might stick in this, give it a little bit extra kick. But yeah, it seems to be working just fine. Because believe me, when, there, when you see a computer like this for $8, you buy it. <laughs> I don't care who you are, you gotta buy it. <laughs> But, um, I think we'll, um, cl shut it down for now. I might do some more videos on this later. But we'll just end this video now. This is Billy Core signing off on July 19th, 2010. Goodbye.